Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May 3rd of 2022. Well, it is titled Mercury's sodium tail. So what do we see here? Well, as we look at the image, we see a cluster of stars and what appears to be a comet down below. Now, as you may guess from the title, that is not a comet. That is actually the planet Mercury. And we can go ahead and label the objects, make them a little bit uh, stand out a little bit more. And we see that the cluster of stars is the open cluster known as the Pleiades, a relatively young cluster of stars. And we see a lot of blue stars there, which are not long lived stars. And therefore, that tells us that the cluster had to have formed relatively recently. So the fact that we still see these stars around means that the cluster cannot be many billions of years old like our own sun, or even 10 billion years old like many of the large globular clusters. Now down below the Pleiades, we see Mercury with a tail stretching out behind it. Mercury does not have much of it an atmosphere, but it does actually have a small uh, atmosphere that contains sodium. Now the sodium is uh, from the surface and then it can be expelled beyond that as Mercury's or Mercury orbits. Mercury has very low gravity and is very has very hard time holding on to material for a long period of time. So unlike Earth, which has a permanent atmosphere, Mercury's atmosphere is constantly being dispersed out into space. And that leaves behind the trail there. And then the tail the trail would then uh, eventually be illuminated by the sun. So the outer layer, the, the atoms of the sodium would then be excited and then gives out that light. So we would be able to see that specific light excited by the sodium atoms. Now this image was taken in that specific yellow light in order to see that. So in order to see that tail, it, it's not something you're going to see just looking at Mercury. Mercury is a tough planet to see as it is, as it is relatively faint and always very close to our sun in the sky. So you would never be able to see the tail directly. However, through special filters and here in an image, that can take a longer exposure, we're then able to see things like the tail that we see in our image today. Now this was actually predicted back in the 1980s that Mercury might have this tail, but it was not discovered until just 20 years ago. And as we study it more and more, it helps us to better understand what is happening with with Mercury and to better understand things that might be going on on its surface. So that was our picture of the day for May 3rd of 2022. It was titled Mercury's Sodium Tail. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Planet Pyramid Parade. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone and I will see you in class.